What's up, y'all? It's Mel. Welcome back to It's Mel B. I'm telling y'all now. This is a very, very small haul. I only spent $20.02 in Walmart. Um, I have not been going to Walmart like that lately. Um, I haven't really been going to any store lately. Um, recently, I went to the Dollar Tree, but I'm really trying to get down to the oldies. Um, I probably go to oldies, oh well, this is previously, no, it's not previously recorded. I'm going to get this to y'all a date. So, I probably get on down to the oldies sometimes next week. But, here go my little bitty Walmart haul. Don't blink, because if you blink, you're going to miss it. It ain't that much. I got a pack of chicken wings. Because I looked I was going to get some uh, wingettes, right? But the wingettes I had was, what? It wasn't even two pounds. And it was $8. I said, they want too damn, they think highly of these damn wingettes and drumming things. So I went over there. It did cost me a little more, but I have more, if you understand what I'm saying. This was only $3.28 a pound, these chicken, winget, chicken wings, but the wingettes was $5.18 a pound. I said, oh no, the hell I will. And I brought a pack of calves to live on. probably eat that on Monday. I'm not sure when I'm going to do that. But, here, take that. But I didn't get too many groceries like I said. I got another pair of tones. Because, uh, I felt like I needed them. I got some bananas. Yeah. I got a tomato. And last but not least, this is my last item. I got me another jar of peanut butter. And so, that's my $20 haul, y'all. That's sad. It's getting to be, well, you can't even buy size no more. Chicken used to be the cheapest thing in the store. Now you got to go rob somebody to buy a piece of chicken. It's ridiculous. Um, here, put this here up for me. Thank you. Uh, but let's, let's run through this. I'm going to tell you exactly how those $20 was spent. <coughs> These chicken wings was eleven seventy eight. This liver was three fifty, three forty, three fifty. dollars No crying over two fingers. Uh, this peanut butter. I want to say it was $2.98. And this tomato, I don't know how much the tomato and the bananas came up to, but these was 57 pounds. They ain't had no price on the tomato, so I don't know. And these tongs were a dollar, so 15, 16, 18. So they were uh, probably a dollar each, maybe. And that's, that's my $20 haul from Walmart. I am waiting to go to Aldi's to uh, really get my grocery on because uh, hey, we just gonna leave it there. Uh, I'm trying to go to Wal Aldi's to get my grocery on. So uh, 
I just eat these few items till I go to Aldi's. You know, I know when I make these, my sons is gonna flock to it. Even though, even though, I'm gonna leave it there on that one too. <laughs> but my baby brought me some pork chops yesterday. Yeah. So, no, you no, know, this baby. my baby right there. This baby. The one I go to sleep with every night. Oh, the next one? No, I only no. go to sleep with you on Friday and Saturdays. <laughs> and sometimes it's Saturday. Right, right. Or sometimes it's Friday. Right. <laughs> or sometimes Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> No, you but don't. Remember, we bored when you was gone. Y'all. Just wait until winter break. I'll be over there. Oh, wow. Y'all get three whole weeks for Christmas? What's wrong with them people? I mean. <laughs> no, because uh, their winter break is also for um, the New Year. So. You act like we don't know what the winter break is. We have one when we were growing up. Y'all did? Wow. How old do you think we are? And guess what? We had more days than you. Right? How many weeks y'all had? We used to get out the whole week of Christmas. Then we wouldn't go back to school till January, sometimes the 8th or 9th. We don't go back January the 2nd. Hey, we had better times than y'all. Probably go back on the Pretty much. I don't know. It's all right, baby. You, it's okay. We always used to go to school around my cousin's birthday, January the 6th. Mm. Like, y'all know, next year, my birthday comes mm. up. My birthday is January 1st. ain't got nothing to say, huh? January 2nd. No, we don't. I don't understand why you would want to come over here. You're a young child. Who wants to be around older people? When I had school break, I didn't mind being by my grandma, but hey, a lot more than just me and my brother and sister was there too. You know, uh, it'll be like the whole clique. We'll start off at grandma's house, then we'll go to this person's house or this person's house, and that's how we did the, the Christmas break. Close that door. Christmas Day, we leave. Oh, Mama, we, we, we go play with our toys for a little bit. Then we go over to, you know, Cousin A or Cousin B house. You know what I mean? These children don't have no idea of fun. But that's all right. So that's my little call from Walmart. Thank y'all for watching. Y'all be blessed, y'all stay safe, y'all have a good one. Till next time, have fun with your family and friends, but responsibly. Take care of each other, stay warm out there, and have a good one. Peace, love, and hair grease. Happy holidays. Happy holidays.